this is a this is a great session that we're about to do. This is what is this guaranteed? I put on I you know you didn't say that Hugo. I said that guaranteed. Build a landing page or build a website for your business in one hour guaranteed. I I set the bar really high there, man. So all right, well I'll try to do my best to <laughs> to <yeah>. to do it. <laughs> all right, well um, let's see here. I guess let's just uh let's just get started. You want to get started? We'll just hop right in sure. there. I'm going to have uh, folks popping in here a little bit, I guess, for the next several minutes. Oh, there's more people piling up in here when they see us go live. They just want to get in here. Great. Okay. Well, let's, I guess, let's give them 35 seconds. <laughs> okay. <laughs> let's do that. Tell us a little bit about yourself, Hugo. What's going on in your world? Who are you? What do you do? And uh, what are we going to learn today? Okay, so who am I? Uh, well, Hugo Melara here. Um, I used to be a high school teacher, and when I started, uh, I was getting tired of uh, just not handling my classroom. So I met Claude Diamond. I contacted him because I wanted to do real estate. Uh, after that, I learned the gut sales system, learned how to ask questions, basically interact better with other people. Uh, I did not go into real estate, but I really love technology. So I developed my own online classroom when I was a teacher. And then from there, uh, an opportunity came uh, to work at Google as a contractor. So I actually got the job over there for uh, two years. I was a sales support manager, helping the Latin American team uh, basically structure deals, uh, secure approvals, and process orders. So that's what I used to do. So I worked completely remotely for, because, uh, you know, I couldn't travel to uh, Latin America every day. So I had to do everything remotely. Um, I was helping on the behind the scenes. But after that, I said, you know, I want to be facing, uh, I want to talk with the clients face to face. So now I work for uh, one of the biggest um, Google partner companies. All we do is uh, we, we sell Google products. That's what we do. So I would say I'm a renewals coordinator slash order management specialist. So uh, I renew the, uh, renew the orders, renew the accounts, I'm sorry. Uh, also do upgrades and, uh, and also process the orders behind the scenes. So I do many things, right, with technology. Uh, and with that, um, after doing this, I realized, you know what? Uh, I think with technology, you can have a good work-life balance. You can go hang out with your family. You can do so many things. You don't, you don't need to be stuck in one place. So um, that's why I'm here now, because I know you guys are working hard in real estate. Uh, and I just want to share some of my uh, knowledge of, of technology. In this, in this case, will be to uh, build a website from scratch using Google Sites. Wow. So I want to share what I yeah that's awesome dude i appreciate you being here thank you so much for being here and you know it's important because it it's we all in the real estate business at least and there's some other businesses and industries here too that are wanting to learn this skill set today by the way hugo so it's not just real estate mm -hmm. but you know customers clients prospects leads that we talk to they they ask a lot you know hey do you have a website that i can you know learn that you mm -hmm. can i see you're a real person and all that well there's some things that we can tell people like that but it's also nice to just be able to say yeah sure i've got a nice website you know and yeah. how do we do it and then I'll, I'll be real with you i'm paying like 60 bucks a month for my website and then i gave i gave hugo a the link to my website by the way and if everybody wants to check out mine our team buys houses at it's our team buys houses.com okay check it out and i gave that same link to hugo and he went over to google sites which he's going to show us this is what we're going to do right now and he yep. built one that looked like pretty much identical to it okay so and i'm and i'm paying 60 bucks a month for mine and he he did it for free so he's going to show when, when he did that, I was like, okay, we got it. We got to get this all right here out in the open. <laughs> okay. So and to follow up on that, uh, to follow up on that, <clears throat> if you build your Google site, it is completely free. You don't have to pay anything for that. Uh, oh, unless you have a, sure. I have a Google workspace account It's 12 bucks a month with that Google sites comes with that. Uh, and the only difference between the free version, which is if you have Gmail, and the paid version is that you can use your custom domain with the with the website. 
if you don't care about having your own domain, you can just use the free one. So no problem. Okay. Can I also throw something out there? And yes. tell me if this is wrong and I shouldn't do it, but our team buys houses.com is my website for, for sellers. Okay. Mm -hmm. So if people go there, if they want to, can they just right click and save some of my graphics, right click, you know, highlight, right click, kind of copy and paste some of my words and just put them right there as we built this website today if they wanted to or do you have some things i just maybe in conjunction with what you have i just want to make that stuff available if anybody wants to just take all that stuff you're welcome to okay is that all right if i do that hugo or is that going to mess with what you got planned oh no no that's actually that's exactly how i was going to do it i'm just going to copy and paste <laughs> okay, some great. of the things you, you've written right uh so if you wrote something just well, I mean, that. I wrote them a... or I stole them from somewhere or something myself. Okay, so I, somewhere along the way, they became mine. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I, I don't really remember, but anyways, yeah, that's how that works. Yeah, and we're only going to do it like that just for the sake of time, you know, because we don't want to go and spend, okay, we're going right. to write this original thing just to show them how, how it's done, basically. All right, great. Let's jump in. I, we've got a nice room full of people here, 17 people. There's uh, quite a oh, few nice. watching us on social media already. And let's go ahead and dive right in, Hugo. I'm excited, dude. Stop. All right. Thanks for doing this. Boom. Hey, everybody, Definitely. follow along. I hope everybody's got two monitors so they can watch Hugo on one and do this on the other. Just yes. saying. And also, if I'm doing this and you uh, lose track, you're like, oh, you know, he's going too fast. It's okay. I I'm going to be recording this and I'm going to edit it. And then uh, I'll talk to Justin to see how we can redistribute this later on. Or maybe you can go to my YouTube channel. At this point, I'm, I'm still trying to figure that out. But um, yeah, so I'm going to be recording this as well. So I know we're live. Uh, let me see. Before I get started, one question. Uh, so the main reason we're doing this is because people in real estate you guys want when somebody says hey do you have a website the main reason you we're guys doing, we just want to give them a place where they can go right yeah or is there another reason yeah. you exactly uh, that's a great point so if you're here wanting to build a website the first thing you need to decide i guess is is what is the purpose of the website who do you want to send to this website a homeowner in my case is what it is a homeowner lead a for sale by owner lead somebody who wants to sell somebody who needs to sell, somebody who's thinking about selling and they saw me on Google or somewhere. Um, I want them to reach out to me. Uh, there might be other websites like a tenant buyer website. So I might want to build a page in this website for that maybe. And you can show us that. But um, yeah, so everybody think, you know, hey, this is exactly who I, because you can't have it all this and that, right? It yeah. doesn't work if it's a little of this and a little bit of that and a little bit of everything. It needs to be, this is who this is for right exactly yeah and we can make it as complex as possible but my philosophy is make it simple the simpler the better because we don't want to uh confuse the the prospects either so i'm a real estate investor i do lease options or whatever somebody comes to me and says you know you know i have my house for sale i would consider doing a lease option or something like that do you have a website something that can explain uh what you do or something like that i would say sure definitely Got it on my phone, just text them the, the website, uh, the link, and that's it. And that's what we're going to do. So I'm going to share great. my screen here. Let's see. Yeah, please do. Okay, you guys see my screen? Yeah, that's 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 what that's my website there that's what that, that is justin's yeah. website i did not build this i just this i want to show you guys what has been done and we're going to use this as a template yeah to, I, uh, and, and i'm not saying that this is perfect i'm just saying that this is what i've been using for a number of years all right so yeah you know make make this yours everybody's okay so it's not, not like i've got the magic website or something i just want to be clear <laughs> about that all right, so this website is great because it accomplishes uh, four main things, or maybe three. Okay, let me see. One, it lets uh, people know who Justin is. You know, he has a, a video here that tells you, you know, what he gives you an explanation of what he does, uh, how he does business. Second, he is able to capture people's um, information by having them uh, write their name, email. 
Um, that way you can build your, um, your email list. Let me see what else. It gives you more information about what he does. Has uh, questions and answer. answer. The, so he, he lets people know what he does. Let's the, gives them his contact information. Uh, the only thing that is missing is a uh, way so he can get paid through here, right? Which we can also put on our website, by the way. So I'm going to go ahead and get started. So since many of you guys don't have, uh, I'm assuming uh, most of you guys don't have a paid work, Google Workspace account, I'm going to use uh, just my simple Gmail. So you're on your, uh, you're on your Gmail. You will go here to the right to this, uh, where it says Google Apps and you go to Drive. Drive is your um, digital storage, your work, your work workshop place. Uh, and let me see, I'm gonna go to business. You can do it anywhere, but basically I'm just gonna find a place here. I'm going to go with new. And right here we have the option to do Google Docs, Google Sheets. I'm gonna go to more. I'm gonna do Google Sites. Create and share. Okay, great. So now here we have our Google site. This is just a template. Uh, how, what are we going to name it? I'm going to name it Justin's uh, website. You can name it whatever you want. Okay, so now I go back to here. It says, Our team buys houses any area, any condition. Let me just steal this from Justin. I hope you don't mind, Justin. I don't mind at all. Please, anyone okay. that wants to steal that title, I, I do not have that copyrighted, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if someone does, but it's certainly not me, okay? All right. Okay, and uh, the way I did this, I highlighted it, and uh, I have a MacBook Pro, so I just press Command-C. That uh, copies it. And here I go and press Command-V. And it just um, pastes it right there. So now I can go ahead and uh, work on the uh, on the font. I could change the the colors and everything, but I'm not going to do that because I want to move along. Okay. So now we want a nice uh, header. So we can uh, we can choose an image. We have two choices. We can either upload one from our uh, computer, or you can select one from Google. So I'm going to go ahead and select one. I'm gonna go search and I'm gonna type house because you know we buy houses, right? So we have all these uh, free images and I'm gonna go down. Uh, let me see, I think there were some that I, I liked. Let's just pick this one, select. Well, there is some ugly ones there. <laughs> if we were in the ugly house business you know that's a funny yeah. thing because i am in the pretty house business so i try to pick houses for my landing page that kind of fit the market area that i'm fishing in like in other words mm -hmm. single family residence like this house right here looks like some kind of medieval castle I right, really, right. yeah i would not you know i know you're just kind of showing us this example but everybody pick pick the appropriate picture yeah, and I just put whatever picture, but yeah, if it looks medieval and people are like, Ugh, you know, my house doesn't look like this. No, we want to pick a pretty one. Okay, so uh, houses, house. Or maybe an ugly one if you're in the ugly house business and you're looking for, right. you know, those type of sellers or or whatever type of web, website page you're building. Oh, there you go. Oh. There's that one. I've seen this one on everybody's website. Has oh. It, <laughs> has it, anybody in the room here ever seen this this exact house on somebody else's website? I wish you could show us the whole thing because that, that one's like everywhere. I think you can even probably find it on one of mine somewhere. Let's see. Has this, this, and... I don't know. We could even change it if you want to. We can do another one. Oh, no, I love it, dude. I, I'm I'm sorry to slow you up. I was just uh, uh, just just thinking about how I've, I've been caught before uh, using pictures that didn't really, and colors and stuff that don't really match and <laughs> you know you, you do want to put a little thought into it a little bit you know yeah and uh no th this is the right mindset that you have you're like you know i want pretty houses but also you know if i've seen this everywhere maybe we want to actually let's just change it real quick it should not take long 
So, and if you have a picture of you of, on your own or upload it to your computer, you can use that. But right now we're just using the, let's see, what about this one? It's uploading, something like that. Perfect. Uh, and if you go here to the right where it says anchor image, you can move it up, move it down, move it to the side. I'm just gonna center it like this. That's cool, that looks good. And uh, if you go here on the left, remove uh, readability adjust adjustment, you can make the picture stand out or you can make it like this so that your, <clears throat> your title stands out. Wow, that's great. Okay, so now we have this. We have uh, our team buys houses, any area, any condition. Actually, let me change this, any condition. And now we're gonna publish this site. Okay, and what are we gonna name it? Justin's, Justin Buys Houses. There you go. Okay. Justin Buys Houses. And this is gonna be the entire uh, URL for this. It's gonna be sites.google.com slash view Justin Buys Houses. Uh, okay, it says there's somebody's already using that one. See, somebody beat me to it. So oh. if you're watching this, everybody, you'll have to be a little creative or, or, and you'll also need to get it. You know, if you haven't started this, you need to get on it because other people are already using your name. <laughs> yeah. right? Mike and so just, Bob and Larry. Hey, it's already taken probably, but check. Now, let's see. Justin buys pretty houses. Oh, no. That oh, that one. Perfect. That's even better. That's more specific to exactly what I want this landing page to be about, too. Wonderful. Awesome. So now we're going to publish it. Every time we make uh, any adjustments and we want to see them, uh, we publish them. So now we go here to view public site. So this is what we have so far. Now I want to test if this URL works. So I'm just going to copy it. Command C. I'm going to open a new um, new window. It's going to be incognito, meaning that I am not signed into this. Yeah. Go here. Hey, and you should put that in the chat so people who are in the Zoom room can yeah. can check that and, and see that this is actually live up on the website uh, up on the internet already. Awesome. So let me see how do I do this because. So Hugo, our URL is that whole thing, right? Exactly, yes. And that's, that's the thing. If you have a, just a Gmail, that's going to be the whole URL. If you have a paid workspace ac uh, account, you can use your own domain, you know. Yeah, uh, let me see. I think, Justin, since I'm sharing my screen, apparently I'm not able that's to okay. see. That's okay. That's all right. It, it's, it's no problem, man. <laughs> Everybody, but I just was... I just think it's it's neat, but it's I'm it's not important, man. <laughs> I think it's amazing how fast you're able to do that. Yeah, I just wanted everybody to see that th that they could actually just do what you just did right there and actually have a live landing page up there. Now they can they can do something to clean up this domain and make it something else, but eventually. But this is uh, this is pretty remarkable, man. Thank you for showing us this. Definitely. Actually, I was able to paste this, but I'm no longer sharing my screen, right? Right. That's correct. Okay. So let me share my screen again. Uh, All right. So he put the link in the chat here. It looks like maybe. Uh, I don't know. I didn't see it there. Here you go. That's all right. Hold on. Seems to, I sent it to Claude Diamond for some reason. There you go. Claude got it. Welcome, Claude. Glad to see you here, man. Thanks for supporting us. Oh, Claude is there. So, can you guys see the the um, the the URL? Uh, no, not in the I chat. Think Claude got it. Yeah. Okay, hold on. What's going on here? Because I don't I don't use Zoom. I use uh, Google Meet. Uh, right above so where you might... type in the chat box, there's a two two, and then everyone, or it still it'll say Claude Diamond there. We'll need to change okay, that to everyone. Okay, so I'm gonna do it to everyone. Yep, there you go. We got it. Everyone. All right, everybody. We now, got it now. There you go. Perfect. So yep. now you can see as this uh, as this evolves. Okay, so let me see. I'm going to share my screen now. Yep. 
share the screen so everybody out there watching can see what it is that we're looking at here. And it's what he just built, but it's live on the internet already. Okay. He told it to go live. So this shows that, you know, for free, you can have a landing page that looks pretty doggone good. Uh, he's just started it though. So I, I know he's got more he's going to do, but I mean, I'm, I'm already lauding this cause that, cause like I said, I'm paying 60 bucks a month for something that looks pretty much just like this. <laughs> and um, like I said, you put your main title, our team buys houses, any area, any condition. I'm already intrigued. I'm like, oh, really? What are you doing? There's a picture of a nice house behind. So I know that he focuses on nice on nice uh, properties. Okay. So the next thing I want to know, I want to know a little more about Justin. Who is this Justin guy? And um, let me see. on his website, he has this um, this video right here. That if we can Hi, start. I'm Justin, and thanks for visiting me here. And I'm going to play the whole thing. But uh, let's say you build a, a, um, a video. You made a video. You can include it on your website. And actually, I am going to cheat here. And I'm just share. I'm just going to copy his. Uh, oops. Just going to copy his URL. We're going to go to our website here. And if you look at the right, you, where it says YouTube, click on YouTube, paste the, uh, the YouTube link. We found, uh, we found uh, Justin's video, select, here it is. So now we're just gonna center it. Anybody that wants to use my video, go ahead because it's got my phone number in it. I'll get all your great leads. And everything it'll be really really nice <laughs> I'm just, yeah i'm teasing <laughs> <laughs> and and also actually you guys if you guys want to put your uh information let's say and i'm going to do it like this i think yeah. too um everybody authenticity and genuineness sells today so do not feel bad about making a little video off the cuff Everybody knows what I mean off the cuff with your cell phone, your iPhone, your Android. The 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 it's great. The cameras are awesome. The the audio's awesome. You know, just get somewhere that looks like, you know, like there's a big house behind you or something and and then just say, "Hey, you know, listen, my name is Rick. I buy houses anywhere in any condition. I'd love to make an offer to you today. Can we talk about the things that are important to you? Give me a call." Here's my number. That's it. Boom. Done. Now you got a great video. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just want to explain what I did here. So for this one, I just put the video. That's it. This second one right here, actually, let me do it again. So I can explain it. I go here to the right and I choose uh, these things where you can have a video or an image, some text. I only need one. So I'm just going to erase this one. I'm going to include Justin's video. YouTube, and you can put any video from YouTube um, right there. Select it. I'm gonna erase the one on top. I'm gonna move it here to the right. And here, um, what do I say? Contact information like email, phone number. Whatever, you know, you can put your contact information here as well. Uh, YouTube channel. Yeah, I can't spell today. Well, you guys get it, right? So now what I do is just, I'm gonna publish it. Right here, it tells you, okay, this is what you have on the right. This is what's currently being published. This is the new, um, the new updates, so. Ooh. All right, so let's go to the button. Wow. Let me refresh it. Our team buys houses, any area, any condition. What's going on? Come on. Let me refresh it again. Sometimes it takes a while. So here we go. Now you can play Justin's um, video Hi, here. I'm Justin, and thanks for visiting. <laughs> I love how you say, I'm Justin. Hey, you know, I got a quick question. It just popped in my mind. I don't know if anybody's yeah. brain works like that, but mine does. And the question is um, mobile optimization. Like, because this looks pretty good on my desk. I'm, right now I'm on a laptop. 
But mm -hmm. what what if I'm on my cell phone and I go to my website that we're building? Is it going to look pretty cool too, or is, does it change for me where it looks good? Actually, I've seen it. It looks it looks pretty good. It looks almost the same as this, except okay. that instead of having like a um, horizontal view, it's more vertical, more more squished, basically. Yeah. But you guys can check it out. I mean, you can take the the link and go on your on your phone and just check it out right there. And let me see. Honestly, I don't like this email phone number, and so I'm just gonna erase yeah. it. This was just an example. So, hey, did you guys see Uncle Claude's video there at the end? That's a great video. You should go watch that, Uncle Claude. Uncle Claude Diamond. We're, we're both Hugo and I are both licensees of the Gut Sales System, and uh, it's changed our lives. You should definitely check that out. Thanks for being here today, Claude. Hey, what's up, everybody? What's up, Justin? What's going on? Who is this? Hey. This isn't Claude. <laughs> this is Rashik. Hey, Rashik. We're building a website, man. What are you doing? I'm coming to watch you guys. <laughs> uh, show me how to build a website. All right, dude. Hey, so right. Kenny said he pulled up at, uh, the website on his phone, and it looks fine. Okay, thanks, looks Kenny. Fine. Awesome, awesome. Hey, Denise B. Okay. also wants to know, if we go to HugoMalera.com, can we contact you and have you do this for us? Oh, uh, if you go, yeah, definitely. Uh, the only thing would be that, uh, you know me, some financial help will be very grateful. I'll be very grateful for that. And we can talk about that. But yeah, we, I can definitely walk you guys through this and help you build it if, if that's what you want. Boom. All right. Uh, let me see. Okay, so right now, we got our team by houses. We have uh, Justin's uh, video. You can write it down and just say, oh, this is who I am. You can write it or you could do a video. I recommend a video. Uh, on my website, I actually have, uh, I wrote something about me and included a video as well. So let's look at the, uh, the other website. So, <clears throat> so far we have these two factors. Then Justin tells us how he works. This is how he works. And, uh, and then he captures people's uh, information. So how do we do this on this website? First of all, I don't wanna write everything down. So I, I'm gonna copy this. It's a, it's a picture, so I cannot just copy and paste it. So what I'm gonna do, I'm going to do a screenshot here. Could you right click and save picture as to the desktop and then upload from that way on, on PC? Uh, PC, I'm not sure about PC. I know I have a MacBook Pro, so I did Shift Command 4. So now I took a picture and it's gonna go directly to my desktop. And that's what I'm going to use. Um, let's see. So what do I do? I'm going to upload, upload the photo that I, that I just took. Screenshot here. And then I'm going to resize it. There we go. How do what what did he what did he say? How do we work? How does it work? Yeah, how does it work? How does it work? How do it work? Yeah, exactly. How does it work? Now this is down here. I want to move it up there. So with this, you can when uh, you move your mouse around and you see uh, that little cross. Oh. No, 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 no. It's not behaving correctly. Bobby says that his friend's a pole fitness instructor and would be uh, totally stoked about making a website for their business. This is this is anyone ever you know whatever business guys, not just real estate. Yep, exactly. Your website should say something about you, and should let people know know how to contact you, and if you can get payments through the website, even better. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to move this around here. There we go. It's also, How does it work? Everybody, it's a little herky-jerky a little bit when you live stream and try to do things like this. <laughs> so yours will be a lot smoother than what you're seeing Hugo have to deal with. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, so now we have... How service. 
uh, do the website on? Oh, is uh, Google Sites. If you have a Gmail, you it's already included with, with your Gmail. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, and I showed in the beginning how to go. Basically, you go to your drive and then just uh, do a, uh, open a document and it will give you the, um, and I can go ahead and show you guys afterwards. But you, you have the option to up, open a new document on Google Sites and then this is what you're doing. Okay. Yeah, I wasn't quite sure. I wasn't quite sure how you got there. So if you could show that a little later, that would be great. Yeah, even here. Let's just do it quickly. So uh, I'm on my Google Drive. Just go new. Go down here more. Google Sites. Boom. That's yeah, it was really fast. And this is also recorded, everybody. So, you know, we can go back and hit the replay if we need to. Uh, but yeah, cause, cause you're right. That, that happened lightning fast again, like twice. And now you, oh, really? if you blink twice, you would have missed it all together. <laughs> okay. Let me do it again. Super quick. Cool. Uh, really, uh, slowly. It's cause it's so you're on your crazy. Gmail. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you're in your Gmail. You have nothing to do. You're like, you know what? I want to build a website. I'm bored or something. Right. So you just go here to the right where it says Google apps. You open it. Go to drive. I'm not seeing it. Oh, there you go. No. Yeah, there you go. I, I saw it. Uh... Yeah. So you and you drive. can use a folder if you want to, or simply you can just go to new, go down where it says more to the right, Google Sites. And now you're just starting a new website. You, you can play around with this. But this is not the one we're using, so. And okay. I can literally so, have hundreds or thousands of these. Is that correct? Yep, yep. You you can have as many as you want, and and it's uh it's free with Google. It don't get no cheaper than that. Yep. And like I said, for people who just joined us, the difference between this uh, free one and the paid version, like if you have Google Workspace paid is that you can use your own um, your own domain on your website. With this one, it's always going to have the uh, sites.google.com slash whatever name you put on the, on the website. But if you don't care, you're like, you know what, whatever, I'm just going to share the link and I have a website, then this is all you need. Uh, let me see. So now we have, how does it work? It tells you the steps. Step one, tell us about your property, we'll review, okay? Now, how do we do this that Justin was able to do? Capture people's um, emails. Capture people's, uh, how do we have people tell us about their property? So you cannot do this on the website, but you can do it on a Google form and you can put the Google form on the website. So I'm gonna create a Google form. So I'm gonna go here, new Google form, blank form. Okay, so everybody okay. tracked that. Now he went back to Google Drive. And yes. He, and he did the, he went to the create new thing menu just over there to the left, like he did before, except this time he chose Google Forms. Mm -hmm. Okay. Tell us about your property. Okay, so we have Google Form. Google Form is great because this is a way to get surveys and just create like an application, even a, a, an application in it uh, for to share it, share the link so people can apply and give you information online. Okay, so now what do I want to do? Question, uh, email. Email is going to be a short answer and I want this required. So I'm going to press this. If a person does not write their email, the, they will not be able to submit the form. Now, I don't want to do this again, so I'm just going to copy it. Duplicate. Boop. And you said you can make multiple of these? Yeah, you can make multiple. So you can have a seller and a uh, buyer's list page. Exactly, yeah. You could have one in every market across the country with a different form and a different page. And it where every page says Kansas City, and the next one says Wichita, and the next one says Topeka, and the next one says, you know, whatever. It's mm -hmm. a, for free. Right, and so once you build one, build one of these, you can duplicate it, right, Hugo? Uh, the for the website. Yeah, when you when you get this website built, like this page here, if I wanted to duplicate that myself, I could 
I could, if it was mine, for example, I could just duplicate it and then change it and not have a different one. I'd have two then, right? Exactly. Yes, you have two. Uh, you can just change things around to make for a different place. And that, and that, and also the URL will change. You know, so that you you don't get sent to the original one. You get sent to the different one. Okay. Boom. So. Thank you. With this one, tell us about your property. We want email. Email is required. So you cannot submit this form without having the email. Uh, we have the name. It's optional. Unless you want to make it required. I'm just going to make it optional. Phone number. Uh, and then lastly, tell us about your property. Tell us about property. I want it to be a paragraph. Perfect. So this is our Google form. Now I'm gonna to go to settings uh, and presentation. I'm sorry, I'm going fast, guys. That's okay. Confirmation. No, but I, I'm just, you, I just was very, very user-friendly. User -friendly. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it is. Uh, what would you say, is user-friendly? Is that what you said? Yeah, I think you said it's user-friendly. Is that right, Kenny? Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah. It's pretty user friendly. It's, it, you know, Listen, it's, I'm not techie, and most people on this thing know it. If, if you can talk to me like I'm four and I can do this, this is easy. Well, that's cool. Good, dude. And good, you know, good. And let's use use mine as a template or whatever, guys. You know, I mean, that's that's kind of helpful too. I think if you're just getting started, you don't even know what it should be like or whatever. That's that's all he's doing. He's just going over there. He's just janking everything right off my page, dude. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go ahead. Yeah, if you see it. Exactly. If you see a website that you like, you're like, you know, I like this website. You can go on Google Sites and recreate it. You know, what? why create something from scratch when you have a, a nice, it's, it's like doing a, a drawing. If you want to do a drawing, you know, just copy a good drawing and make it your own, right? Well, what about uh, pictures that you take, like, say, like the sky, the woods? Can you like, kind of like use those type of pictures also? Yeah, yeah. You can search it on Google right there. And I think I showed them before, uh, before you came I'm, in. I'm original, man. I like to take my own pictures. I'm, I'm a scenery person, you know. I'm always Perfect. taking pictures. He's a creative. You're a creative. Yeah, you know. <laughs> <laughs> then just have it on your desktop and upload it to the website. Either that oh, or if people who are not uh, creative or who don't have time to take pictures, you can uh, you can look for them on, on Google. So it's, it's, uh, this is for everybody, you know? I like to create my own things on Photoshop, so I, I upload them here. But if I if I don't have something, then I'll just use Google. Now, quick question. How do yes. you set it up where a prospect can put, like, you know, you ask them information about their property, where they can input that information? Is there a special way, or something special that you would have to do to have yeah. that set up? Yeah. Actually, that's exactly what we uh, we just did right now. Yeah, he was just, he did, uh, he was just showing that. Yeah, boom, right there. Yeah. That's property. Gives your email, name, phone number. Tell, up, tell mm -hmm. us about your property. Okay. Now, the last thing I was doing, go to settings. And this is the message they're going to get once they uh, they uh, they submit the form. And uh, Justin, what would you like to tell? Let's say I go to your yeah. website and yeah. I submit the form. Great. What would you like to tell me? I would say <laughs> success, exclamation mark. And then... Please feel free to call Justin immediately at, and then my phone number. That's what I would do, okay? But that's that's just me, everybody, all right? I, I'm going, and then after that, if you still have room to type, I would put in there, Justin will call ASAP, period, if you left your phone number. If the phone number was an option there, which I always think you should get a phone number, everybody, too, when you're asking these questions. Another thing, you know, you can have any questions you want, all right? So mm -hmm. if you're making a tenant buyer site, you're going to want to ask questions like this. Are you looking to rent to own or just rent, right? You're, are you, how much money do you have for a uh, down payment for your next home, okay? You, so how, you can how, have how long of a rental term are, do you need before you're ready to buy? You know, you might want to ask some questions to pre-qualify. But so mm -hmm, you can do mm -hmm. whatever you want here. But he's just he's just kind of copying my quick, easy seller yeah. site where I send home. Hey, say, Justin was uh, how much money you have? Or, what were the things? Can you repeat them so I can include them on this? So oh, well, uh, yeah, let's just do, um, you know, are you looking to rent to own or just rent? And so it would be two questions. You might have a drop down 
uh, where they can select, I'm looking to rent only, or number two option would be rent to own. Okay. Does everybody understand where I'm going with that? Yeah. Or, or, or you could ask it like that and you could have a yes or a no answer, or maybe you could just force them to type out an answer. It's yeah. all up to you, but you can have different style of questions there too. And actually, I'm not going to include that because that seems to be more for people that want to buy the, the well, home. Sure. This is, sure. This is for the ones who are selling their property. Exactly. So just gonna... you, exactly. You, so can you have, my question is, go ahead. No, go my ahead. My question man. is, okay. so can you have two formats, one for the for the seller and one for the buyer? Yep. Definitely. Yep. Two formats? Okay. Mm -hmm. you, can yeah. have as, so, you can have as many of these as you want in whatever ways you want, man. They're all free. Yep. So. Oh. Okay, now we have this, this is our Google form. So what we're gonna do now is send it. We're not gonna send it to anybody. We just press send to get the link. I'm gonna get a short URL. I'm gonna copy it. And now here comes the magic. We'll we go to our website. I'm gonna create a button. This button, I'm gonna name it, uh, tell us about your property. And I'm gonna link I'm gonna put the link of the Google form here. Here's the button. It's like a little call to action button. Exactly. Oh, I'm gonna move it down here. There we go. Now I'm gonna wow, publish that's it. That's easy. That's super cool. Yeah. Dude. I like that a lot. I feel I feel like I just saw the backside of a magic show. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. That's so cool, right? I, I, I like it because once I found out about this, I'm like, what? Well, you can do all this with this? Okay, so I'm going to test it out now. Uh, new incognito window. Here's the website. Go there. I want to sell my property. And I'm like, okay, you know, Justin, I think he's he's a cool guy. Yeah, look up there in the top left, or up there where, uh, above where you just put in the domain. It says Justin's website. That's the name of it. Yeah. How cool. Yeah. Yeah, so this will be the domain, sites.google.com yeah. slash view, yeah. but look Justin right Buys that. Pretty House. Yeah, look right above that, though. It says Justin's website is the name of this page. That's really cool. Mm -hmm. I could name so it right now, I want. And, and it's free. That's cool. Yeah. You know, that's the best price. <laughs> yep. So now we have this. Blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay, you know, I'm interested. I want to tell Justin about, well, okay, so this is the how it works. You know, let me tell Justin about the uh, about my property. So I'm going to click on this, and it sends me, where does it send me? It sends me directly to this site. So I'm going to go, uh, Hugo, Nara, 725. Actually, my business email, Hugo, at hugomalara.com. My name is Hugo. Malara, phone number is, which, actually, let me just give you the, it's 510-200-8800. Uh, um, Tell us about our property, great conditions, but I have to move as soon as possible. Oh, I love that. That's a good lead. I'm going to call that lead right away. As soon as I get this lead, I'm calling that one. But how am I going to get this one? Is this going to show up on my phone or my email? How am I going to? Well, let's see. We're well, going to show you guys. Okay, so great conditions, but I have to, I have to move as soon as possible. Willing to do creative. Willing to be creative. And I'm going to send it. And right here, once I send it, here's the message from Justin. Success. Please feel free to call Justin immediately at whichever number, or Justin will call you as soon as, po <clears throat> as, soon as possible. Sorry. Great. Like so cool. that's what I see from my side. Now, Justin, uh, he will get an email. Yeah. Now, what will I get? Yeah. As the, yeah, actually, as the guy that owns the site, when somebody fills it out, what am I getting here? Yeah. Did I connect the email? Maybe I didn't connect it, but uh, let's see. If you go back to your this, we get a response. There you go. What is this response? Okay, we have an email, Hugo, uh, name Hugo Melara, phone number, great conditions, but I have to move as soon as possible. Okay, great. Now Justin is going to go ahead and call me. 
But what if Justin gets a bunch of these in one day? How does he keep track of them? Well, uh, Google Forms has a Google Sheet already integrated. So you just click on this, create. And right there you have email, Hugo. So let's say he has like 20 of these. This will capture, this Google form will capture the emails, phone numbers, and names of whoever uh, fills the form. So okay. that way you're building email. That's awesome, email. Hugo. There's a question here in the chat. How did the site get Justin's email? Do you mind if I answer that, Hugo? Sure. Do you remember when we started this, we logged into Google Gmail and then we went to Drive. So we're doing all of this out of my Gmail account. So it knows automatically that this is being, that I want these leads and stuff sent to our team buys houses at gmail.com. I hope that makes sense. So whatever email you want to work out of, make sure you're logged into that one to begin with when you start this process. Otherwise, you know, switching it over will be uh, difficult. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, that's how it is. Everything is done from your Gmail. Your Gmail is will be like your airport that sends you to uh, Google Forms, Drive, and all that stuff. Uh, Hugo, when he got that lead and you just pulled up that that Google Sheet, is that something automatic or do we have to set that up too? Um, it's automatic. So once you, once you uh, build the, um, the form, let me see, let me pull that up. Once you build this form, Anybody who, uh, once you build it and share the link, anybody who fills out the form and submits it, you, you, we get uh, responses automatically. That is that automatically. And if you want to put them on a Google Sheet, you just press here and, it, and they build it for you automatically. Yeah. yeah, that's great. Now, what's cool about that, everybody, this is a little more advanced, is once it hits this Google Sheet, now it becomes available information for other programs like Zapier. If you're familiar with Zapier, it's not a Zapier class or anything, but where now you can have it do pretty much whatever you want with that information. So um, really, really cool way of automating. And I run my entire business uh, with Zapier and Trello and a couple other really, really inexpensive things. And, you know, I don't mind. I like it that way. You guys, you could do it that way, too. Mm -hmm. Okay. And for sake of time, let me see. We could do this. Our team buys houses. You explain this. Actually, let me do it real quick. I'm going to include that on the website. Let's see. Um, our team buys houses. So I copy and pasted this, but since it was, it was a white, um, white color letters, we don't see them. So we just highlight them and we go ahead and change the color. So a visitor to the site to answer the question in the chat gets to the question form by clicking that big blue green button right there that says, tell us about your property. Exactly. And if you guys want to test it out, you can go ahead on the site right now and just fill out the form. And uh, when you fill it out, you, you don't have to put your email. <laughs> it could be a made up one. Um, so we, we can see how many, if you, all of you guys can do it. Uh, we'll see that everybody, we're gonna see all the responses here. Yeah, everybody uh, put the link back in the chat again there, Hugo. Everybody go there, click the button, fill out the form. Let's just see how many responses we can get here. Let's just get several responses from people here in the Zoom room. Definitely. Right. Yep. Publish. Go there and he's going to put the link in the chat room in the chat box here. And go ahead. If you're in the Zoom room, click the link, go there, and then click the big green turquoise button that says, tell us about your property. And then just write in some silly stuff. Okay. Yeah. Just write us a note. Say, hey, this is me. I'm going to have some pepperoni pizza for lunch. And I'm so excited about it. I can't wait. All right. Whatever. Just let us know something so we can all see that this works. Mm -hmm. And while you're doing that, let me see, let me add this section right here. All I'm going to do is just get all this and uh, copy it. Con I do command C and then I just, you know, like this. Mine auto fill too. 
Oh, really? With your email and your your name and all yeah. that. Yeah, that's yep. great. That, that's one. Yep. That's nice for prospects. You know, prospects are lazy. Yeah, I hear you. I like that. That should be the that's that's the that's the phrase of the day. Prospects are lazy, so we got to make it easy for them. Okay, and I'm giving more time for people to fill that out. So now let me see on the website. I added the other the other section. And sorry, guys, I'm going fast because of sake of time. So we have now we have this how it works. Our team buys houses fast. It tells you what how it works. And then just it even has a, a question and answering uh, section. So let's do this one real quick. This is this is incredible how, you know, when, when you don't have people talking in your ear like me, you can really get this done pretty quick, everybody. <laughs> but this is great because uh, what you have given me, Justin, has made me actually do a better website. I did one that's more basic. But with what you gave me, what everybody's giving me, I'm, I'm building one that's more useful for Great. what you guys are trying to do. Great. Okay, so we get frequently asked questions. I'm going to add a divider up here just so that there's a divide. So, you know, so people see that, oh, this is yeah. a different thing. So, so what I want to do is I want to I want to put the right. question and then the answer. Mm -hmm. Yes, right here. I'm going to do a con. con Collapsible group. No, no, so I can literally put a YouTube video. A can you put a calendar over there for people to click on book days to book a call? Yeah, wow. Oh, yes. And actually for that, let me show you. This is my website. You know, just like, just like Claude does and Justin does. Yeah, I yeah. can totally yeah. get in there and tinker with that stuff, everybody. Is anybody else in here a tinkerer? Because I'll get in here with this later on today and I'll tinker for a while and just kind of explore. Because some of that's mm -hmm. pretty, pretty cool and he ain't going to have time to do all of this. Yeah. So first of all, to do that, you need to build a booking page in Google, Google Calendar. You, but you can only do that on the paid subscription. Okay. So... Um, I have one, here's my website. Schedule a meeting with me on my booking page. People can just come here, click on it. And there's my availability. You wanna meet with me on Tuesday at 3 p.m.? There you go, you just right. book it. There you go, and that's Perfect. it, right? Uh, let me see what else can we done. Also with mine, I also included a video that walks you there's a free uh, tool guide that you guys can get here. Uh, it just tells you about the physical and digital tools. And one thing that I just added is a donation page. So if you guys feel this is useful, uh, any donation is appreciated, right? Yeah, and, but you will need a, a PayPal account. Everybody throw him some, throw him some coin, okay? <laughs> All yeah. right. You know, sometimes it's just prudent to give. All right. So... Make make the positive decision to buy somebody lunch today or something, you know. And I can say any donations just to needy children, which is my children, because they're very needy. Yeah, he's got he's got hungry <laughs> children he has to feed. You know, that's what's up. Yeah, I think that's awesome to have that on there. Where after you uh, you know help somebody if they uh, want to help you, that's a beautiful thing. Well, I think here yeah, that's awesome, Ed. And what we need to do is we need everybody. I put the link there. We need everybody to go test it out. Okay. Just go test that button out and see if it works. Somebody give him some money right now. Let's see if it works. <laughs> Let's see if he gets a notification. <laughs> yeah, I really it. appreciate it. <laughs> hey, hey, everybody uh, wants to test out everything else, but nobody wants to test out that donate button. Uh, you're breaking yeah. up. You're breaking wait, up. Wait, wait, you wait, 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 <laughs> wait, what? I couldn't hear. <laughs> well. Using the donate button guarantees good luck for at least 10 days. So there you go. There you go. Uh, Great content. I love that's it. It's also guaranteed. Yeah. This is, this is great. I'm most definitely going to be working on my uh, website today. Cool. And like I say, if you guys want me to help you build one or something like that, just email me or go to my booking page and tell me what, what you need. You know, I'm, I'm always willing to help. Um, I'm pretty tech savvy. Well, if you can no, do it. I'm not one of those dinosaur guys. 
Good, good, good. <laughs> I love the energy here. Okay, uh, let me see. Uh, I'm sorry, it's having. It's kind of hard for me to build this and talk at the same time. Okay, so now we have this. We have we have the website. Tells us a little bit about uh, Justin, and down here we have the um, question and answers. So what I did is I built a collapsible uh, button, which says, are you actually listing my house on the MLS? And you can just press here and it gives you the answer right there. So that way it, the answer is not just right there. People can uh, choose which answer to click on. I don't know if it makes sense. Uh, let me see, actually, oh, look. So we got emails from Potato Head. I ate a potato for lunch. We have other stuff. So now <laughs> we have, it worked. That's great. Let's go, Brandon. I would like to have you make a bunch of money. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, definitely. What up? Great condition, <laughs> but I have to move as soon as possible. Yeah, man, those are, hey, and there's going to be more porn in here. Everybody, hey, thank yeah. you. <laughs> thank you for putting that in there. And right here, see, if you go to your Google form, it says five responses, but you could even have, uh, let me see, your, this uh, Google Sheet bookmarked to your um, to your computer. That way, you know, you can always check it and then you will see as uh, responses come in. You will get the emails, names, and any message, basically. Okay, and let me just do one more for the question and answers. Do you pay fair price for properties? Uh, so we can just literally add anything we want over there on that right, that menu to the right. We can pull anything we want over there mm -hmm. anytime we want. And we can do this. We can change this anytime we want. If we ch if we did something today, we, we didn't like it. It wasn't done. We want to come back to it tomorrow. We can edit this. We can change this anytime we want, 24-7 and it's automatically exactly. and immediately saved on its own and done mm -hmm. auto saved and when you hit publish up there in the top right hand corner boom it's live that's it exactly mm. see, my you contact so hugo at hugo malera.com okay yep it's just let, my name. Let me put that in the chat in the Zoom room, but that is going across the screen on YouTube and other places. Feel free to go there, make a donation. If you got something out of this, buy Hugo lunch or something. <laughs> okay. Uh, or, you know, or buy him, a, buy him a Mercedes or a Ferrari. You know, that'd be really cool too. Would that be all right, Hugo? If somebody oh, that would be great. Up, my, my son would love that one. He loves speed. There you go. You know. Okay. Like, uh, so on the last one right here, frequently asked questions. Um, are you actually listing my house for sale? I don't care about that question. Do you pay for prices? Oh, I do care about that one. So I go here. Boop, and then there's the answer. And uh, so far, oh, this great. is what we built. This is the website we built. Yeah, and, and, uh, and less than an hour, really, because I've really distracted you a lot. But yeah, so... Oh, no, you... You guys gave me great information. Actually, I think we built a we built a better website because of all the feedback and all the uh, everything you guys gave me. Yeah, and I think this looks pretty nice for you know just throwing it together on the fly like this. And um, what does it everybody else think? Does this look pretty good? Would you be Would you be interested in using a web page like this? I mean, is this pretty? Oh yeah, for you? it's simple, direct to the point. It's cool. Cool, cool. You know, somebody wants to know in on in the land of YouTube, with this type of website, how do we get or do SEO optimization? And I think really what's cool about this is this is already a Google site. So Google is already ready to push this website. They want to because this is one of their own. You know, mm -hmm. Google loves its own, right? So YouTube loves its own. So, you know. It's all, they're, they're all related. They're all Google. So I think this is probably another workshop you could do, Hugo. But um, but anyway, did you have a quick answer for that kind of thing? 
SEO that optimization guy. and and getting this out there in the world as far as on ranking on the pages, I guess is what I'm 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 assuming she means. That I'm not sure about, you know, still learning okay. about that. Okay. Um, yeah. No problem, dude. That's cool. I appreciate it. We got a uh, a bunch of people here in the Zoom room. I do we want to answer ask any questions? Uh, have a Q and A. Anybody want a Q and A? Hugo, can we do Q and A? Is that cool with you? That's cool with me, man. Uh, another thing that I'm thinking about, I'm thinking about doing uh, maybe other courses aside from site building a site. Maybe how to use uh, Google Sheets or something like that. But I want to know what's important for you guys. For what's important for people. Uh, because not everybody's tech savvy. I, I wasn't. Honestly, uh, I think that was one one good advantage when I came into tech is that I wasn't tech savvy. So when I learned it, I made things simpler. I explained it simpler to people who are not tech savvy. That's what I want to do. I want I want people to use this technology, but not have a PhD on the technology, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I appreciate that, Hugo. This has been a real blessing for us. And, I got a question. Okay, great, Lou. <laughs> hey, here you go. Hey. Uh, hey, so if, if someone puts in an, uh, a phone number and and uh, it, it comes through, is there a way of having it uh, ring your phone or, you know, or do some kind of notice that it'll ding on your phone so you know someone's actually trying to get a hold of you? Actually, well, for that, I actually recommend Google Voice. So like I said, I have a paid Google Workspace account. It's 12 bucks. It's business standard. With that, I added uh, Google. Actually, let me. Uh, can I share my screen again, um, Justin? Yeah, absolutely. I use Google Voice too, everybody, and that's how I know not to pick up when you call. I'm yeah, <laughs> I'm teasing. I answer my own phone, like Uncle Claude says. So you know, yeah. But it's it's all. I got the app on my phone, so if I can turn the notifications on or off, it's kind of nice. You know, I can turn the business on. I can turn it off. I, yeah. yeah so cool. for example here uh here's my website and uh, my website this is my gmail can you guys see it by the way yeah okay so here since i have a google a google voice account as well as 10 bucks a month on top of my 12 dollars of a google workspace so i go voice i can open this up and from here i can make phone calls from my computer send text from my computer as well but the cool thing is that if somebody calls me and leaves me a message, I would automatically get uh, get an email transcribed with, transcribed with the transcription of uh, what someone said. For example, let's say uh, Justin calls me and says, hey, Hugo, give me, give me a call back. He leaves that message. I will get an automatic email with, uh, with that written down, you know. So uh, you can connect your email uh, to your phone with Google Voice. I don't know uh, if that that helped, <laughs> but that's what I use. And that's pretty cool. That's a good answer. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Google Voice transcribes, you know, all that exactly. stuff. It's great, man. I like it for that. So, so. You, got the paid, you got the paid version? Yes, I got the paid version. There's also the free version. Uh, you guys can get it. I got the paid version just because I have more, more control of it. I think there's... Uh, yeah, because it goes directly with my domain and stuff like that. So, yeah, but you can get a free version. Yeah, I was just gonna ask what was the difference. I mean, Different. I got the version, but I didn't know with the paid version. Um, do you got more options with the phone itself or something? Let me see. With the the main reason I got the uh, <clears throat> the paid version is because it wouldn't allow me to get a free one when you use a, a workspace account. It's because it's for businesses, right? Now, if it's just for you you can get it get it for free unless you already picked another number then you can you can only pick a number once right i think you get like a domain with it like a, a pretty domain name and i think also um your email can be now like hugo at hugomalera.com instead of just like you know hugo at gmail.com right. is, is that right Exactly. So what the first thing is, I bought my domain through GoDaddy, but that was before I knew you could also get it through Google domains. And if you get it through Google domains, it connects really well with uh, Google sites. 
I had to do some tweaking around to connect it to my Google site. Um, the reason I got the paid version of uh, Workspace is because I got like two terabytes of storage and I want to put a lot of videos in there and then share them. I want to sell them as well. What else? Uh, also, you also get to uh, build your own your own booking page. So that that's why I, I also got the paid version. And then I just added so the, the Google paid version. You get a domain with the paid version. You get a domain. Oh, no, the, with, the paid version does not give you a domain. You buy it differently, but you can integrate your domain with the paid version on, on, okay. on a website built through Google okay. Sites. Okay. Yeah. I was asking because um, I know somebody, not in this group, but somebody else was saying that they uh, use the paid version phone for their VA in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that too. Uh, let me see. For example, me, let's say I get three VAs. I can give them an email uh, that would say, let's say somebody's called, I don't know, um, uh, Felipe or something. Felipe at HugoMelara.com. That, that would be their email. Um, and then I can also go through the admin console in a Google Workspace. I can see what they're doing. I can see how they're using the uh, the apps. I can uh, access lo logs to see what you know what they've sent, what they've shared, and stuff like that. So it gives you more control uh, once right. you when you have a paid subscription. If you're going to have uh, people working with you, basically. Got it. Right. So that's great questions. Anybody else have another question? Any other questions, anybody, while we got Hugo here? Okay, I'm I'm trying to put this pin number in because I'm sending you some I'm sending you lunch money. Oh you are <laughs> awesome. All right. Let me know if you get it. Well, I, I could check. Let's see. Oh, hold on. Uh, wait, I just finally hit the go button. Yeah, there we go. Thanks for donating to Hugo Malara. Oh, shoot. Let me see. Let there me see you go, I Doug. Can... Hey, thank you for being here, everybody. Uh, follow suit, you know, throw him something for oh. for being a blessing here. And, thank you uh, so much. I received it, actually. It was great, dude. Great. Oh. Good. So great you know, content. He could, uh, you know, he could be asking Thank us you to so buy much. something. He could be asking us to buy, some, you know, his training class on how to do this for, you know, fifty dollars or twenty-five or a hundred or whatever, you know, how it is. But he's not. So, and he's not beating his own drum or anything. I'm just saying, you know, if you're inclined to go donate, love you guys. Uh, anybody with any last questions? Anything? No. Okay. Cool. Appreciate everyone. Yes, it was a pleasure being here. Thank you guys for allowing me to you know, be here and, and sharing this with you guys. And you guys, guys can always contact me, email me, any questions. You know, if I don't know the answer, I'll look for it. And I, I want to help out. That's what I want to do. Well, thank you, everybody that's here. And we've got several people that have left. But, you know, everybody uh, go check out Hugo at HugoMalara.com. And then yep. you can check me out at ShutUpMoney.com if you're interested in that. But... Hugo, thank you so much, dude. We oh. want to we want to be friends and like long term yeah. and have you hang out with us and bring us any good stuff like this you want, man. And let